And if he's not around, I just do it by myself. It's just a little easier. I get all my stuff rounded up. Then look who pulls in. He was cleaning up the last job. Pulls in right in time. It's beautiful. He's looking at me right now like, oh, I don't want to get Well, good morning. We're just pulling into the new landing here. Uh, it's about 15 degrees, 17 mile an hour per winds, uh, cold, straight up really cold. Uh, but the only good thing is this place is freezing down and that's a good thing. So, landing's just right in there, there's a little opening. There's just a little wet spot right there that was here before, but it's supposed to be cold in the next few days. This place is gonna freeze in harder than a rock, so it's a good thing. But the wind died down for the moment, which is nice. Just for the video. I must what it's for. So. We just had to move this down the road just a couple miles. That's why we got the Freightliner hooked up and not the three axle truck. So we just had to slip it down the road real quick. Should be a good thing. That's a wet spot right there, but that's gonna be totally fine. Once we get this cold weather, it'll freeze in the night real good. So we'll deal with that. What a difference a day makes. It was rainy and 35 yesterday and now it's 15 and snowing, but just a little bit of snow. Now what I do is I get back here where I wanna be and he bumps me with the bumper. It's easier said than done because you cannot see around that chipper in the truck. Either side you can't see behind you. into here so whoo cool that's gonna have to work there that's a little better now the trucks can back in a little easier just a really tight landing and it would be a little tricky but what do you do ah. this is just a thinning we just took uh, some of the maple out looks like the clump maple and the popple I'll make some more videos on what this job has got going on but I'll let you look at it. This is when I, after it's cut. So 
we try to keep our jobs looking pretty 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 and Adam the cutter guy I've explained this in videos I get a lot of questions on why I don't record him he won't let me so we got a cat 573 C bunch we're running and he puts down enough wood for all of us but that's what it looks like there guys real good job nice clean and uh, I'll take some more videos when we're done but yeah looks like we took the clump maple some popple a little bit of oak I'm not sure if we took some or if it was just in the way but yep that's what it looks like when we cut it all nice and pretty laid out now if the skinner guys can just keep her nice and clean we'll be good to go we'll see what happens if you were to ask me on a scale of one to ten how happy i am that we are here four thousand very happy look at that throws up trucks are moving these are uh, those days that you keep uh, just keep rolling you know when things are going bad you hope for jobs like this we're here it's a good thing my knives are garbage yeah I mean they're bad all the way through I replaced the outer ones but I didn't replace the inner ones since we did all that oak and uh, they'll wipe out your knives real quick so I'm gonna swap those out getting some trucks out today finally and uh, it's beautiful it's beautiful I mean so nice so nice I was getting all my knife stuff rounded together air compressor was out of gas got that done and when I got to change both sets it's hard to do it for, my, for myself because I got to reach down to get that the bottom clamp off and that disc is 30 36 inches so I got to reach all the way down the back side and I usually have Paul help me and if he's not around, I just do it by myself. It's just a little easier. I get all my stuff rounded up. Then look who pulls in. He was cleaning up the last job. Pulls in right in time. It's beautiful. He's looking at me right now like, oh, I don't want to be on camera. But it'll be a little easier. Get these all taken out of here. 